Okay, everybody, we are ready to go with Lauren Stiverens. Go ahead and start with uh, Lincoln Arneal. Uh, Lauren, that was quite the performance you had out there tonight. Uh, how did it, I mean, obviously you had a rhythm with Nicklin, but what was it like out there for you? Sorry, they're testing the horn. Uh, what was it like out there for you on the court and what kind of rhythm were you in? Um, <laughs> I mean, that was nothing new for us. I think that um, ever since Tyler's come back, we've kind of um, had a lot of focus on offense and changing it and stuff like that. And basically what <laughs> we try and do now is Nicklin tries to get me the ball and anyone the ball from wherever, and we are always up. So um, that's pretty much how it goes in practice. You'll see her flinging it in from 10 feet off the net and 15 feet off the net. But, yeah, it's nice to have Tyler here to change things up. And, yeah, it was nothing new for us. It was pretty much what we've been doing. So it was a lot of fun. You terminate like that at that rate in practice? I mean, 18 kills on 20 swings, that's typical for practice for you? I didn't even know that. <laughs> um no, because our block is insane. Um, unfortunately, that's where we kind of fell short today. But um, no, I don't terminate like that in practice, but I try to. <laughs> Andrew Ward. Andrew Ward. Hey, Lauren, uh, just how did it feel playing a match in the Vanny Center with, you know, there were some fans there, but it felt a little weird out there. Yeah, for sure. It's definitely different. Um, it's been an adjustment for sure. And I think the first two sets we were kind of, I don't know, a little bit quiet and like waiting for something to happen. And I think it was, we were missing our fans, but um, we finally got it together and figured out how to bring our own energy, which um, I think is going to be very important moving on the rest of the season but yeah it's it's different and it's sad but it's what we have to do to play so Austin Kingsley hey Lauren you were um attacking from a lot of different spots on the net I remember in the first set you uh scored the last point of the set from the left side um and you were hitting in front of the setter and behind the setter did you envision having this big of a role um, in the offense where you're pretty much getting the ball just anywhere and still terminating for 850 on the match? Um, I think it's something that we've always talked about and wanted to do, but um, yeah, it's been, it's been, Tyler has brought so many different aspects into the game and we've changed so many things and it's nice to mix things up because ever since I've been here, we've pretty much been running the same offense and doing the same thing. So it's been really nice to, switch things up and, I don't know, <laughs> get the ball from pretty much wherever and do pretty much whatever I want. So it's kind of nice. Jacob Padilla. Hey, Lauren, what was the team reaction when uh, Ani went out there and served up an ace on her first career point? Oh, my gosh. Ani is such a team player. Like, she puts the biggest smile on my face when I talk about her because that girl gets after it every single day. And she is a stud, and there's not one person in our gym that is not an Ani fan. And to see her go in and get that ace, I think that just made everyone's day just so much better because she's that type of person. She's that type of player. Like, she's, she's exactly what it means to be a Nebraska volleyball player. So that was amazing. Lincoln Arneal. Lauren, you mentioned that you have to bring your own energy. How do you go about doing that? And how do you go about doing that in a different manner than like you would in a practice? Yeah, it's just, um, I mean, I don't think it's any different than we are in practice. I just think that we need to focus on the communication aspect of the game because there were a few times where between plays you could, like it was silent in the gym. There was, you could hear a penny drop and I think that was so different for us being in like game mode and like having all this energy and um, I don't know, adrenaline. And then to just not hear anything is so, it's such a weird dynamic. So I think we need to get better about like, I mean, just not focusing on anything else and just focusing on us and bringing our own energy and stuff like that. So I don't know. Did that answer your question? I kind of got lost as I started talking. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> Brent Wagner. 
Yeah, what's uh, what's fun to you about the different ways that you're getting getting set ball, set the ball this year? I mean, it's the same for everyone. Um, Nicklin has just completely changed her game, and she is, I mean, chucking balls in from wherever to whoever, and to see her. Um, I mean, it started off kind of slow and a little bit rough, uh, like the previous practices and whatnot, but to see her get more comfortable with doing that and for us to have that kind of like confidence and like bond to be able to do that in games is something that's so special. And we were trying to do that against Indiana and it wasn't really working. There were a lot of misconnects, but to see it come like full circle and for us to be able to execute in games is something really special. And I think that she's going to be an amazing setter this year. I mean, she already is, but she's taken it to a whole nother level. Last question from Jacob Padilla. What do you think about the fans that are over there kind of heckling Maryland during their serving? I love it. I mean, someone's got to do it, right? <laughs> uh, no, it was actually so fun, and those are most of our friends anyway. And I mean, not mine, but <laughs> girls' boyfriends and stuff. And so it was just a lot of fun to have a little bit of flavor in the audience, <laughs> if you will. But um yeah, that was that was great. It was it was a lot of fun. Even though there were not many people there, they still made the most of it, and so did we. So, yeah. Okay, thank you. We will be back in a few minutes with Coach Cook. Thanks, guys.